Howdy folks, Tech Scrubner here with Tech Scrubner Outdoors. And today we're going to be talking about Death in a Lonely Land by Peter Hathaway Capstick. This is going to be another book review on some very fine adventure literature. This is the cover of the book and the back of the dust jacket has a picture of the author. It's also richly illustrated as all of Capstick's books are with line drawings. This one has line drawings from Dino Peravano, who is a very talented black and white artist. And so in this book, it contains some of Capstick's more famous stories and more famous gun writings. He talks about 20 gauge versus 12 gauge, shotgun pellets, waterfowl hunting. There's some fishing in this book. It involves the entire world of hunting and adventure. And I highly recommend this book. This is actually one of my favorite capstick works. I like it better than Last Horizons and it features one of his most famous stories the black death which is the african cape buffalo which is featured right there on the cover it is a very exciting read and because it is a bunch of small writings it is a very quick read you can pick a story that you want to read one night and it's only going to take you about 20 minutes but the trouble is once you pick a story then you don't want to really put the story or put the book down he is a very engaging author and the stories are not only comical at times they're frightening and there's a lot of adventure to be found in these pages it has adequately readable type that is of a large font and I love this book there is also some stories in here that you can no longer do there are a few stories in this book involving jaguar hunting which has since been outlawed due to population loss because of deforestation not through legal hunting and so there are some controversial stories in here involving the hunting of large game and dangerous game all over the world but if you like adventure then I think that investing in a copy of Peter Hathaway Capstick's Death in a Lonely Land you wouldn't regret having it in your bookshelf and I highly advise that if you do have it in your bookshelf, that you read it. I am a big, big fan of Capstick's hunting literature, as well as his firearms literature that's also contained in this book. And it's full of great, great adventure stories. Obviously, I'm not going to tell you what they are. But there's Leopard, and there is Jaguar and there is fishing there's even a little bit of pig sticking in the book and so highly recommend peter hathaway capstick's death in a lonely land i think if you pick it up even at the library that you might enjoy it and it will give you a glimpse into the life of a pretty amazing man and a very interesting writer so as always, God bless all my Ted Nugent blood brothers, the sportsmen of America. Join the NRA to protect our rights. Thank you very much to those of you involved in law enforcement and those of you serving in the military. And thanks for watching Tech Scrabner Outdoors.